F double R, F double R, F double R, F double R. Gotta bring that energy. What's going on, friends? I'm your host, Brolic. And I'm your host, Formal. And welcome back to F double R, Friend Request Reviews. Today we have Breaking Bad Season 2, Episode 10, Title Over. Now, with a title <laughs> like over, what you think is gonna be over, huh? For this for this episode. For me. Um You already know Breaking Bad titles be crazy. I guess I guess uh I guess the news that Walt got from last episode that, that the cancer was going away, maybe he feels like you know things are the bad things at least in his life are over. Okay. Uh, so maybe so maybe that's what this episode is gonna be. Maybe it's gonna be like a heartfelt, rejoiceful kind of episode. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Like, cause they did that four day stretch, that was crazy. But they also got good. Well, at least Walt got really good news with the cancer. So, so yeah, maybe, maybe that's what we'll see today. Okay. So you are thinking the the bad news is finally over? It's finally about to, you know, start a new chapter in his life. Okay, all right, that's interesting. Well, with that being said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. The goal is 1K. If you haven't already, hit that notification bell to let you know when we go live. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's go. You know what's almost over? This season. Can't wait. Man. Can't wait. They bagging and tagging. Mm, evidence. <laughs> A whole bucket full of evidence. <laughs> they go to whip that he always driving on. Somebody. Uh oh. <laughs> Dang, who about to get body? <laughs> Walt always driving his baby mama's car to the most dangerous places. Like I say that every time I see it too. Like hey. he bringing people straight to the crib. He not a he not in that life. He don't know nothing about that life, bro. Just take the rest of the week, please. You earned it. Don't push it. My boy want to work, Besides, man. I want you well for the weekend. Ooh. What's going on? Mom wants a party. Hey, hey. You feel me? It's just a little get together. That's all. You feel me? They got Sunday afternoon. You like, what friends I got? I burned all my bridges. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Hey. Beautiful. See, man, Team Skyler. Yeah, Skylar seems she like she's she. back to normal, you know? She's still working for that sleeves, though. True. But her spirits are up, you know? Yeah, her spirits are up. I've seen her smile multiple times in the past 30 seconds. <laughs> Look, he feeling himself. Like, you see my man? He like, I can do this. It's over. <laughs> Wait, drink that OJ. The upshot is that I have radiation pneumonitis. Mm. Actually, it's not as bad as it sounds. For real, because it sounds terrible. It does. In fact, the news is all good. It's all good. It's all vague. Not to imply I'm cured. I still have cancer. But there's been a significant reduction in the tumors. Significant. How significant? Say it. 80%. Yep. <clears throat> Dude, no yeah. way. I don't mean my boy. Out of the woods by any stretch, but they've been taking in those methane gases. I'm sure. <laughs> Just the word they keep I'm in a super being about. <sighs> Mr. White, you kicked his ass, yo. No. Yo. <laughs> you must be so psyched. It's crazy that everybody else is way more excited than he is. Yeah, that's because he don't know what the hell to do with his life now. He made he he made a decision solely based off that cancer. Mm -hmm. That's true. We'll take our time and stay cautious. Sell off what we have, I guess. Guess what? 
I'm done. Done. I'll give my man's the recipe. Six hundred thousand, you out the game. I mean, that's a good. That's a good come up. Yeah, but that's a lot that they have to sell, though. That's true. A lot. <clears throat> we really do want to thank you. Who are these, these people? I don't know none of them. Few months have been. Uh... They are not friends. <laughs> Look at my man's right there with the ponytail. <laughs> Look at my man smiling like, what is you so happy about? He's in Breaking <laughs> Bad. That's what he's so happy about. Bro. He's like, I made it into an important scene. <laughs> oh, she thinking um, Emily, you know? I'm, yeah, Bridget. Emily, right? When I got my diagnosis. Look at that random dude from the cartel right there. Like, I said to myself. The mean Mario mustache. Know, why me? <laughs> and then... The other day when I got the good news. I was like, why me? <laughs> it just got dark. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> he said, uh, anyway, like, he going to just press that all. Be a cold bastard. Heisen, man. <laughs> He's <said> inspirational. <laughs> well, what's the word I'm looking for? Anyway, uh, <laughs> Tortuga, gone. okay? That was the name of our Yo, snitch. Yo, my boy chill it, man. Bean speak for tortoise, okay? He said bean speak. This motherfucker is wild with it. Like. <laughs> he said bean speak. He tried to slip that in there. He didn't think I was going to catch that. I was about to say, he about to give his son a little junior. <laughs> like, like it. Go ahead. Man. Hey! <laughs> Everybody has this one day, though, when you when you're that age. Yeah. You know? Yeah, you take a little hit with your pops. Yeah. I wouldn't know. <laughs> I mean, not with your pops, with your moms or whoever. Yeah, somebody, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> hey, he took it, though. <laughs> got the little cough out there. He took it. Oh, I know his yeah. chest burning a little I, bit. I think I see your hair. <laughs> Maybe two. <laughs> Why Walt looks so disgusted? <laughs> like, yeah, I don't know what's happening. Like, look at him, bro. Like a drunk fish. <laughs> we were drinking Moscow yep, stupid. Junior too. But uh, hey, yo, hey. he about to get him. <laughs> <laughs> yo, he wild. He about no, to he not. Another one. Yes, he is. <laughs> he tries. I said, nah, bro. Don't do it, man. Yo, <laughs> yo, what's up with my man's? Yo, it's over, bro. You about to take Hank? Well, he took it though. He took the shot over there. That's three shots in, bro. He can't even walk properly. Like, how you gonna let them hands get sauce? The bottle. Now. Mmm. Mmm. The pour for me, bro. Pour that shit in. Look, he about to. <laughs> oh, he, <girl. laughs> he Heisenberg, yo. He finding straight bliss in that right now. Hey, this is Skylar. Please leave Man, me. Man, he back in the doghouse. He just made it out. <laughs> like, I feel it though. Apologize, you know. Mr. Berg. Son probably took a sick day. No, he sent that man to school. <laughs> he probably wanted to go to school. He's like, I ain't chilling with dad no more. Ah, oh. what you been working on, boy? Mm. That's one of the dudes I was at the party. Like, you cannot <laughs> beat the thermal efficiency of a C3. That's what I like to hear. Mm. Ooh. That's that blood money. Man, go ahead and just throw that in the ATM, bro. <laughs> Let's hover a man. He can. Oh, yeah, surf, my boy skate, be drawn out glide, there. Whatever, because he's always got a never seen his six work, inch though. cushion of air under his feet. And this is? It's a. Backwardo. <laughs> Backwardo. Oh, no, I actually I changed it to Rewindo. 
Anyways, he goes backwards. Okay, that's why the thing goes reverse. Race. Time and stuff, like time traveling. No, he just um, he just walks backwards. <laughs> <laughs> he walks backwards. Is that a superpower? What you know good is that? He did this. No, I mean. I gotta go. Where? Hey. That's her dad, man. <clears throat> Out the back door with it. Okay. At least he knocks for a while before he tries to walk in. Well, I was in the neighborhood. I was wondering if you wanted to grab some lunch. Sure. Yeah. Hey. This, uh, it's your dad? Why, Jesse? Yes? Hello? Hi. This is the new tenant. Go back inside. Sorry, did you need something? He's not getting the hit. Bro, like, uh, no. Dad, why don't you come in? It's nice seeing you. <laughs> like, come on, bro. Like, <clears throat> he ain't touched puss in so long, he don't even know what to do. Like, I mean, he think he back, he back the good one. You know what I'm saying? So he just... I trying mean, to get it good with did, the dad. But they ain't have that con they ain't have that conversation. Dude. That's true. That's why he need to play his part. All they doing is knocking boots as far as I'm concerned. In ignition. Bingo. Okay. Hope I'm not messed Ready. up. He got this. All right, let her rip. He got the official chisel. Ooh, Tankless. Nice. It didn't even spit out no residual brown water, just straight the lid. <laughs> My boy got sauce. Son. About yesterday. Uh, I'm sorry about the pool. <laughs> I feel very foolish. You should. Um, you and Uncle Facts. Hank, you, you, you seem pissed off. You don't even no. know why. No. We're fine. That's the one person fine. he ain't called yet. I called him this morning and... No, he didn't. My Did apologies. He? I don't remember that call. And for that, I'm, I'm very sorry. But I kept up, right? No, you <laughs> threw up, bro. <laughs> you and Uncle Hank. I drank three. <laughs> Might as well give him his last pat on the back. Come on, man. <laughs> My boy said I kept up, though, right? <laughs> I'm ready for these high school parties. <laughs> what you seeing? Oh, that's that, that water. Damn. Damn. That junk pulling in there like Play Doh. He was waiting. Hey. Hey. What's like that, yo? Before, with your dad. Oh, okay. So I totally just misread your total diss. You acted like you didn't even know me. So? <laughs> He's so, hurt. My boy You think I'm gonna be, be all like, hey dad, meet the stoner guy who lives next door, and by the way, I'm sleeping with him? <laughs> Talking about us. Us. <laughs> there is no us. You and me. I just like the pipe. Who's you and me? Damn. <laughs> she cold. Bro, I wonder who her last tenant was. <laughs> My boy left her in the crib, though. So Jesse and Walt kind of going through it. Not so much Jesse. Jesse just in his feelings. Well, I Walt definitely. They just both it. seem bored though. Yeah, they yeah. They both just seem very bored. Then you cut it all out. Just cut it out and start fresh. Well, better get to it. it, it is the whole house gonna collapse or something? Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like not if I can help it. No one under there, bro. <laughs> You a chemist, man. What you got going on? Not if I can help it. Skyler? Mm -hmm. Starting to break. You can't be having no emotions around this dude. Don't be trying to, uh-uh, bruh. This, this man is snake, son. What's wrong? It's hormones, motherfucker. Move on. Being that rock takes everything you got. Facts. My boy out here spitting. Cause she the rock while she was pregnant too. Mm -hmm. While she is pregnant. So going hard. All right, that's it. Enough holding. 
wins. He grabs it back. She went back for the hand grab. And he came back with the double. With the double. She said ain't nothing changed, man. She's bored. He need to pay some attention to his wife, man. He out here wilding. That man don't even come to the table no more. Like <laughs> She's just like, I don't know what the hell's going on. Man, she done washed her hands. She don't even say nothing to this dude. <laughs> He making all them dad noises. Like. He really is. <laughs> <laughs> like, God damn. They really let it play out, too. Oh, yeah. This is Jessica Jones. Oh, she drew him a little picture. What she got going on? Quick prediction. What you think it is? <laughs> it's freaking Rick Wardo. <laughs> <laughs> What's that man name? Rewindo. Rewindo, yeah. Back, but it was Backwater at yeah, first. Yeah, Backwater. It's a rent. Bit. Oh, apology, girl. Hey, <laughs> he hella excited. He about to go. He 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 seemed like the type that jump in his girl's arms and grab his legs. And his arms. <laughs> 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 ah, yeah, he's stupid. Like. Acetone. Oh, you know there's another dealer. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> he see a little him and Jesse over there. <laughs> what you Stay do? out of my territory. I'll send the ATM smasher on you, bruh. Dang, Heisenberg got people backing up off him like that. Look at his face, though. That just brought him so much satisfaction. Right there. <sighs> there we have I it. Episode 10 in the books, Breaking Bad. Man, how you feeling after watching that episode? I know it was a little slow burn, you know, but you know. He had to throw that in there real quick because he knew. I was about Come to on, like, I already know. I already know how you how you start off here. Yo, double already got <laughs> that shit was so slow. <laughs> like, but nah, uh, like I said, I'm used to it now, and I just really enjoy the, the atmosphere that Breaking Bad brings. Like, it's just a it's just a great setting. Like, the characters are are fun. Like, they they good. Um, but that specific episode. It was it was interesting, like because I remember um, there was a couple episodes back where we were kind of speaking about like how Walt, uh, and this was before he even was getting better, but like he was kind of transitioning back into his regular life, but still had the Heisenberg complex like, yep. coming along with him. Yep. So like, I feel like this episode played a lot on that. Like he he. He's bored, like, and I said that during the episode. I'm like, bro, he's bored now. Like, he didn't got a taste of the life. So now being back here got him just like, what? You know what I'm saying? Like, like they say you drop one addiction, you pick up another. Like, his his first addiction was out there getting. His first addiction was hustling. Yep. Right? And now that he had to drop that, he's sitting there addicted to trying to fix his house. He's just trying to do something. Yeah, he's trying to stay busy. And you feel me? Like... And it sucks because now we're seeing some deterioration between... I mean, we've already been seeing the, the marriage deteriorate, but it's looking bad because now Skyler is, is making some very questionable choices. And I wasn't hoping to see that. Like, I, I was hoping she was going... I mean, she could still remain loyal. Like, she, she probably just entertaining right now. You know, the hormones are going crazy. And, and Walt's really not... He's not doing his job as a man, to be honest. He needs to be paying attention to his wife a lot more. Okay. Um... But what else? What else? Oh, yeah. And then the, the episode started with the wild intro, like how they normally do. Sometimes they get us quicker to the answer of the intro than 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 usual. But this time it looks like they're going to hold out on you. Boy. I feel like that's something that's going to be closer to the season. For now. I mean, we're close. We're only like three episodes away anyways. But do you have a very interesting? Do you have like a, a, an idea yeah, do you of have what's an happening? Idea what, what that could be? Honestly, all I could think, like. 
all I could think of is it's gonna be some retaliation. Like Heisenberg right now, he I feel like he's gonna be he's gonna do something reckless. Like like kind of what he just did was reckless. Like he just walked up on like Heisenberg ain't got no muscle. Like that dude could have punched him out, bro. Yeah. Like in my opinion, like just Easily. from the body size alone. And Heisenberg is sick. Like he could have punched that man out, but like he backed him down. And like you said, his his face after that, he enjoyed that. So I feel like he's probably gonna do something reckless. Like. And he's gonna do it in wifey's car because he's always riding around in the hybrid. <laughs> and someone's gonna and someone's gonna track that. Like someone's gonna, gonna come back. Or maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe some Tuco retaliation or something. I don't, I don't know, man. Cause because you gotta, you know, the cartel is, you know, they're in this show. Like they they make they're their appearances not. here and there. They're definitely not. And I can't expect some regular meth head off the block mm-hmm. to like track, you know, the car back to the crib. Mm-hmm. But someone messing with the cartel, they they could potentially get that type of information to figure out what my boy is looking at. Um, I don't think the bodies belong to Skyler or Walt Jr. And okay. obviously not Walt himself. Um, yeah, I don't I don't think that's gonna happen, especially not in season two. Mm-hmm. But yeah, some bodies are definitely gonna drop at Walt's house. Yep. Some something's crazy. They bagged up all types of evidence and put it in a big ass freaking winter clothes bucket like yo yeah so something crazy gonna go on here um what else happened this episode though jesse, jesse over there yep. going <laughs> and his it. feelings man with freaking old girl freaking what do, do, <sighs> do you do you see where, where that relationship might head do you think you have a, an idea where, where where that might head man like I, I, said, I don't know because a, I... we only have Three, we have what? Yeah, three more episodes before the season finale. So, I mean, that don't mean nothing crazy got to happen in the relationship, right? In, in this season, yeah, <laughs> I that's don't true. think so. I don't no, know because I remember in the beginning, I was like, they just gonna be meth head buddies. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's definitely she don't mess with the meth. Yep. Um, so that's cool. It doesn't mean she can't get pulled in, but I don't know. She she might stay away from it. Um, I don't really know her relationship with her father yet. Like she said, he's a little bit of a hard ass. So I assume he's like a, you know, just like a real estate agent who probably wants something, you know, good for his child. And it's obviously not going to be someone like Jesse. And that's why she acted that way. Yeah. Um, and that's why I was saying he needed to just play his position, like play his part because they didn't establish that. Like that's why, I, like I get it. Like I feel where he at. Like he hurt. Like he been spending actual time with this girl. They've been, you know, sleeping together mm-hmm. physically and emotionally and stuff like that. Like so, I get it. But like y'all haven't, y'all haven't spoke about nothing. Though. Like y'all haven't. There's no substance in y'all relationship. Like all you have been doing is just smashing your next door neighbor. Basically. Pretty much. So, like I, I, I get it. Like. Um, but I don't know. I don't really know where that relationship is headed. I don't. If she stays a daddy's girl, I don't think it's gonna last for them. Okay. You know what I'm saying. So, so, all right. One more thing before we wrap this up. What did you think about the whole Walt and Hank situation? Because they both butt heads at uh, you know at a point of this episode. So, what what you think about that situation? How how that can affect? their relationship you know going on in the future so that was interesting because i always figured Walt would want to keep hank very close like you know this way if hank ever does stumble upon what Walt's doing you know maybe a slap either turn him or you know a slap on the wrist and you know just don't do this again Walt, like type stuff like mm-hmm. you know something like that like hank is someone you want to keep your mind he's literally dea yep. like that's what he do like and your name is out there on the streets like they know about highs and um, so that was interesting because I honestly don't even know why he was like why he even went off like that. I mean, I know he he was taking shot after shot at that. He tequila. was yeah, like, he was that awful. was that that brown tequila too. So my man's you know what I'm saying he was on one. Um, but like I hate to say it, and I almost said it in the episode, but when when like Jesse, I mean not Jesse, when Walt Jr. took the shots and started coughing and stuff, I was like looking look at Walt like he he like smiling like it's like he's taking pleasure in people's pain right now for some reason like so i don't know i, I don't know why he pressed him like that maybe yeah. Walt just he had a little snapping point like because i mean i feel him like hank i feel like hank always kind of has annoyed walt but walt is just not a confrontational dude like he you know he, he kind of introverted like he just want to chill like you know his thing yep. but you know his heisenbergness is changing things up for him so it was interesting. I don't know. And I don't believe that he called him. He said he called him in the morning. Did I miss that or am I tripping? 
don't think he was. Involved. Um, during the episode, there was no. At phone least call. they didn't show it. Yeah, right? they didn't. Show yeah, they didn't, they didn't show anything. So. so he's also lying about, you know, fixing the relationship. So I, I don't know what that's gonna bring, but he needs to be careful because that's a that's someone he needs to keep in his corner for sure. For sure. I agree. I agree. Definitely keep your enemies close. You know. Mm-hmm. All right, man. So yes. with that being said, don't forget to like. Don't forget to comment and don't forget to subscribe. Hit that bell and notify you when we go live. And don't forget the goal is 1K so you can help some brothers out to reach our goal. Have double R out. Get out this bitch, man. Peace. Peace.